be showing you how to make a doll size sketchbook. Right now all we have is our cover cut out from our printable. So the first thing we're going to be doing is taking our cut out. We're going to place it on cardstock, not gluing it yet, and we're going to trace our cover. So with the cover traced, it's kind of hard to see, um, we're going to take it and we're going to put it just a little bit above our line so we have room to fold for the paper that's going to go in and we're going to trace it again. With our lines traced, now we are going to cut out the entire shape that we traced out. Now that it's cut out, we're going to take our nails, it's a little harder with our fake nails but we're going to do it anyways, and we're just going to push on the lines where they're traced so we can fold our sketchbook and get it into shape. With your sketchbook all folded and ready, we are going to take the sketchbook cover and we're going to take our craft bond and glue it into place. Now we're going to take our sketchbook and we're going to trace out just a small little pile of papers and once we get them all traced, the size of our sketchbook, we're going to cut them all out. We have our paper cut out and we placed it inside of our sketchbook. And we had to make sure you make want to make sure that all the edges are lined up. And then once you get it in here, if you find that any of the paper sticks out a little bit, then you can trim it out, trim it down. Which you're going to have to do again once we're done gluing it. So, now that we know we've got it at a decent size, we're going to take our paper out. We're going to grab our glue gun and we're going to put just a light amount of glue right in the seam here. And we're going to place our paper in it. Now with everything glued in to place, you're just going to want to take it. And now that you've added the glue in there, it's going to cause your paper to protrude. So you just want to take your scissors and just very carefully trim the excess paper so you can make your sketchbook look nice and even. And if you find that some of your corners came up, you can just apply some more craft bond and then you've got your sketchbook. Now we're going to show you how to do a small doll size pencil. So for our doll size pencil, what we're going to do is we're going to take a toothpick and we're just going to cut it at about the size we think we would need for a doll, which I do a little under half. And you just want to cut it. And now you're going to want to take a nail file and just file this edge up here. Make sure we get it nice and smooth so our kids don't get splinters or we ourselves don't get splinters. Now we're going to take a pink highlighter and we're just going to very lightly make a small portion of the top pink with our highlighter to make it look like a little eraser. And if you can't get the lines perfectly even, that's okay, because we're going to take a pen and draw around the eraser anyways. And you just want to dab it on the top to get the top pink as well. So now once we have that, before we do our black, we're going to take our orange pencil, and we're just going to color all the edges down to just a little above the tip. So we're going to color all of that orange. So now we're just going to take our pencil and we're just going to draw a line around the bottom of the pink and try to keep it as straight as possible. With that done, we're just going to take a pencil. It usually helps to use a regular pencil, but all I can find are mechanical ones right now. So we're just going to take it and we're just going to kind of color the tip in the color of pencil lead. And that will make our pencil look like an actual pencil. 
Now with everything done, we're just going to take a light amount of Mod Podge and we're just going to cover the pencil in a very thin layer to keep it from fading. And once that is done, then your sketchbook and pencil will be complete. Oh, I think that's the last of the boxes for now. We gotta wait for the next shipment. So what are you working on there? Oh nothing, just a little fashion design. You know, for my book. Trying to come up with some new styles. You know, I think I should talk to the owner about selling some of those. That would be a good idea. Sketchbooks are pretty big, right? Yeah, I think so. They're pretty big, yeah. Can I see some of your designs? Yeah. Here you go. These are fantastic. You should try hooking up with my sister and doing some designs together. You really think so? Yeah, I, I saw some of your sister's stuff in Skeddy's, but I wasn't sure if she wanted to design with me. Ghoul, cool. you sh totally should. Alright, but that's it for our episode. Thanks for watching Yuko's Crafting. Danoshimu. Danoshimu.